Hello, this is Rob here from robcoven.com and wpblogtalk.com. I'm going to create a new Google Plus page today and I'm going to then put the badge in the sidebar of the page and I'm also going to show you how you hook up your website to your Google Plus profile which is all very important of course for SEO especially given that Google is putting much more Google Plus results and personalized search in the SERPs nowadays. So here's my Google Plus profile. I've already got one page and I'm going to create another one. So I'm going to go into Manage Your Pages there and Create Here. I'm going to do it for my website. So I'm going to call it a product or a brand. Give the same name as the website name for now. Put the URL of the website there. I'm going to select category. I'm going to call it website. Publicly visible for anyone. And I agree to the terms. Okay, put a tagline in for the page and upload a profile photo. And for this I'm going to use the favicon of the website. And there it is. Got some horses outside. And just tell your circles about uh, the page. Finish, and there is your new Google Plus page. You can start the ball rolling by putting something in your stream. And edit the profile. You put the photos in um, across the top of, of the page and the last one we want to say add to circles that will be below the button where you can add the page to your circles. So the next thing you can do is to create a badge for your website. And what you need is your Google Plus page ID. And you get that here. And put it in there. And there it is. Down here you need to place this code into your header of your website. And I'm using Genesis, so you can put that here in the Genesis theme settings. And then this bit of code needs to go in the sidebar. So I'll go into widgets and create a new text sidebar widget at the bottom and put that code in there. So now I'll refresh the web page Hopefully that badge will now appear there. There it is. Just like to say what else I've done on this site so Google knows that I am the author of this site. Here I have pointing to my Google Plus profile. There's a, a link that's on all pages. Um, that is rel equals author. On the About page, I have Rel equals Author as well. And if I go into the About page, and if you scroll down, there's a link to the Google Plus page, and that is Rel equals Me. So if you go into the Rich Snippet, Snippets testing tool, um, Google says that it doesn't give me any errors because the site is linked to the profile at Google+. So, I hope that helped you. This has been Rob Coven from WPBlogTalk.com.
Thank you very much.